Hi all, welcome to the new episode of Tech Insert. We are going to make a lead acid battery charger with auto cutoff functionality using TL431 regulator chip. The TL431 is a three terminal adjustable precision shunt voltage regulator. The appearance is similar to a BC547 transistor. With the use of an external voltage divider, the TL431 can regulate voltages ranging from 2.5 to 36 volt and at current up to 100 milliampere. We cannot give this directly to the battery because of small current, but we can drive a relay which can handle high current. TL431 is used in SMPS power supplies, battery chargers, over voltage protection circuits, etc. Here, once the battery becomes fully charged, then TL431 will disconnect the battery from the charging voltage with the help of relay. Once the relay cut off the battery, then the relay will not re-energize and connect the charger to the battery. Thus, the battery will be safe from overcharging. We need to disconnect the input and reconnect for again charging the battery. You can charge the lead acid battery overnight using this circuit and you do not even worry about overcharging of the battery. Once fully charged, TL431 will disconnect the battery from charging circuit and stay like that until we disconnect and reconnect the input to the TL431 circuit. The circuit diagram is given at the end of this video. Actually what the circuit is doing is sensing the input voltage drop. When the battery is charging, then the current flow will be high at the input. Thus, there will be a small voltage drop. And that drop is sensed by the resistor divider network consisting of 2.2K and 470 ohm. When the charging completes, the current flow will become nearly zero and then TL431 will disconnect the output from the input. Do not skip the video because I will be explaining a lot in between the testing time. Please do not forget to click the like button. Before connecting the battery, I will show you how the circuit is working by connecting this motor to the output of the circuit. You all know, when the motor starts running, the current will be high and after it reaches its full RPM, the current reduces. Because of that property, here when I connect the motor, it will rotate for nearly one second and then disconnects because it reached its full RPM. You all know that when we are holding the motor shaft while in operation, the current will increase. What I am going to do is, using this paper cushion, I will give a little friction to the rotating shaft and thus increasing the current. Let's see how our circuit is behaving. After some failures, you can see the red LED is lighting and the motor is running. When I release the pressure in the shaft, it disconnects which means our circuit is working perfectly fine. You have to give correct pressure to the shaft. If it increases, the motor will not rotate. And if it reduces, the circuit disconnects the motor from the circuit. 
After successful testing, it is time to test our circuit in the battery. I do not have a lead acid or maintenance free battery with me. I have a 12 volt lithium ferro battery. I disconnect the BMS from the battery and is directly connecting to the charger. The input voltage is fixed to 12.6 volt. Please watch the LEDs. I am connecting the input power supply now. The moment I connect the input supply, the red LED is lighting, which means the battery is in the charging state. The battery was deep discharged. Now we will measure the input voltage using the multimeter. I was given 12.6 volt at the input and let's measure the input voltage while charging. Since the battery is discharged deeply, I am expecting the voltage of below 11 voltage. It is showing 10.1 volt, which means it will take more than 2.5 hours to charge completely. If you have any suggestions or doubt related to the circuit or video, please comment on this video. I believe that this circuit was very much useful to you. If yes, please click like button and also share this to your electronics friend. Please subscribe to my channel for getting more videos like this. That will be an encouragement to me for making more things like this to you. This is Tech Insert signing off. See you in another video. Till then. Goodbye and please take care.